And many Mizzou students started the process of moving into their dorms today. ABC 17's Ben Fine attended a Zoom press conference with the university leaders to find out what the university is doing to make sure students are returning safely. So our staff are trained and, and ready to enforce those policies, and we're taking them very seriously to ensure uh, that the residential environment is as safe as it can be. Many incoming freshmen at Mizzou hauled their luggage and furniture into their dorms as what Tyler Page, director of Res Life at Mizzou, calls a decentralized move-in takes place. Students are going to be required to report to their halls to check in. Page says this process will be spread out. So for freshmen this year, uh, move-in is spread over seven days. Um, you have to have an appointment, so you're, you're scheduling your arrival time. Students are also asked to move in within 90 minutes of that check-in time to allow the next wave of students to move in shortly after. The university have also taken precautions as far as those move-in procedures. And um, the students as well as guests, everybody's required to wear a mask while they're in the residence halls, and this will be a policy that's maintained throughout, uh, throughout the academic year. Safety has obviously been a top concern for MU leaders. Bill Stackman, Vice Chancellor of Student Affairs, says the school has gone above and beyond to ensure they're following all CDC recommended guidelines. Everything that I saw um, and that I know exists is certainly um, on par with, with the guidelines um, and uh, and city ordinance and university rules. Another concern for many parents is what happens if and when students are to test positive for COVID-19. Page says that the university has prepared for this extensively and have plans in place. We have an isolation quarantine policy um, or procedure that you know, we have the ability to implement at a moment's notice. That was ABC 17's Ben Fine reporting. Now, another big change to move in this year is students are only allowed two people to help them move in.